Hi there, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you what I've been buying clothes wise for the boys. If you haven't been here before, my name's Ali and I'm a mum of four and we live by the sea in Wales. I've got two girls and two boys and I've been sorting through all their clothes because we've been in lockdown so it's something to do isn't it? Organise and tidy the house and so I've been organising all their clothes and a lot of the clothes from my five-year-old boy get saved to be passed down to my one-year-old boy, obviously. Um, but my one-year-old boy needed lots of new clothes. Um, so while I was sorting through all the clothes, I noticed that my five-year-old also needed a few um, bits and bobs. So I put in a big order with Next, who I could finally get a slot with. And I also managed to do a little H&M order as well. Um, a couple of weeks ago I did post another video about um, what I'd been buying for the boys. Um, I think that was mainly for the baby, sort of a couple of bits for my older little boy now. And I think that's pretty much going to stock them through for the summer. A couple of these bits are matching. I don't know why I didn't really sort of twig before, but I used to love matching the girls. Um, and now the little baby, my baby's walking. Um, of course he just looks like a little boy now rather than a baby and I thought oh, I can match the boys and my five-year-old's really excited at the thought of them matching so he loves wearing matching outfits so I've got a couple of matching outfits to show you so first of all from H&M I got quite a lot from H&M for um, and they split my order into two so this is the second lot to arrive these are little linen trousers I really like comfy clothes on babies so they're elastic to waist, they're really soft, and yeah, just like obviously really flexible and comfy. They've got a little cute pocket on the back. Uh, drawstring waist, so they're adjustable, and they're really lightweight, so they're perfect for summer. Pretty much identical to those are these. They're exactly the same style and fabric. They're just a different color. These are sort of like a white pinstripe. So they'll look really cute, like a white t-shirt or a blue t-shirt, or something like that. So they're lush. Also from H&M I got a set of three t-shirts. I say I got a set of three t-shirts, I'm not sure they actually came in a set. It's so long since I bought them now, I can't remember. Um, there's a little white one which like I said will go with those trousers. They're just plain cotton, little button detail there. They're really lightweight, so that's really cute. And then exactly the same style in this green colour. And then lastly, exactly the same, but in this mustard colour. I do quite like to keep their wardrobes quite simple. I don't really like um, too many pictures or slogans or stuff. Um, so then they can mix and match it a lot more. Also from H&M, I got these two polo neck t-shirts. I'm not sure if I showed these in the last video. I can't remember. Um, but these are super cheap as well. They've actually worn these a couple of times, hence they're a bit wrinkly. I've dragged them out the washing pile. Um, they just look so cute in these, they're really like, they're half smart, you can like sort of dress them up a little bit. Um, and they're like nice cotton fabrics. So there's that one and I also got this one. I like to dress them in a bit of brighter colours if we're going out somewhere, not that that's happening at the moment. Um, but So I can see them better basically. To go with those I got some shorts from H&M. How cute are these? They're like little chino shorts. They've got adjustable waist, which is obviously really important for the kids. Little pretend pocket there. And they've got real pockets. Um, real pockets on baby's clothes. That's so cute, isn't it? So I've got the blue ones and i got these sort of more khaki neutral start ones. So they go with both those t-shirts. And I've got these in both sizes for both the boys. So they can be matching with the matching t-shirts. Now everything else I got from Next, I'll show you the rest of the matching stuff first. So I, again, I haven't brought down the matching ones, but I bought these dungarees from Next, which are super cute. They're like a, quite a thick jersey, so they're for cooler days. Um, got a little pocket on the top, and obviously your little dungaree bottoms like that. Um, yeah, they're just really cute. This little waist is adjustable and they've got pockets. Um, and this, these are the ones for the baby obviously, but I've got bigger ones for my five year old. And they look super cute matching in those. They came with little black t-shirts underneath. So that's like a whole outfit in one if you get that. Then the other matching thing I got, can you tell I've got a thing for dungarees? Are these, I haven't ironed them because they've been wearing them when it was bank holiday weekend. 
these little um, dungarees. They're like that. Um, I don't know what you call this. It's like a like a linen-y type fabric in the pale blue and white stripe. They've got two little pockets on the back. They're short styles, and they've got their dungaree fastenings, and they've also got little buttons at the waist. They're so cute. And these are the ones for my five-year-old matching. So they're just yeah, they're just adorable in those. And for the baby, I just put a white short sleeve vest underneath and just a white t-shirt on. And to here for my little boy, yeah, they're lush. So yeah, that's all the matching bits, a couple of matching outfits. And then some of this I couldn't get matching, but my eldest would have loved it. So this is like loungewear for the baby. It's like a dinosaur print. This is from Next. So it's got dinosaurs and dinosaur footprints on it. And it comes with matching joggers. Again, that's like a bit of a thicker material, so it's for like a colder day. But um, again, it's just really comfy and perfect for him if he's like playing in the house. And again, it's got little pockets. I've got a thing about pockets. And then the last thing for the baby is another set of t-shirts. So I'd already got him, you've seen the short sleeve t-shirts. So then I got him some long sleeve t-shirts from Next. And these came in a pack of four. These packs from Next are really great value. Um, so it was a pack of four for £18. And they're all sorts of in... in pack of four it's a pack of five um 18 pounds so it's like a blue stripy one a navy blue a darker navy blue um like a white speckled one and then like a marl blue yeah they're just like i to hold them up to show you properly there's nothing special about them but they are just um Really, really handy to have. Nice cotton fabric for again, like for cooler days in the summer. Then for my biggest boy, I got him some new pajamas because he needed some sort of summer pajamas. I love next pajamas. They come in big packs, so I got a pack of three, and these are in the same dinosaur print as I just showed you there. And so it's just a t-shirt and shorts set. I would have got these for the baby, but they didn't have them in their size. And this is the other set, just stick big dinosaurs on. And then this is the last set, sort of a geometric triangle print. They're just, yeah, perfect for the summer and soft and comfy to wear in bed. And the last things I bought from my eldest boy, I bought him some new hats. I think he's recently lost a hat on a walk. You know what boys are like. <laughs> So I got him this one which has got sharks on and then just a plain blue one so they'll go with quite a few different outfits. Um, normally he has a straw one which is the one I think he's lost, I'm going to have to look for it but I do like the straw one because it goes with like everything um, whereas these wouldn't go with everything but um, it's useful to have a couple because he loses them. And the last thing I got was joggers for him. These look huge actually. I got him six to seven. He's not even six yet, so I don't think he's gonna fit these for a while, but I've just gone through all his wardrobe and basically thrown all his joggers. Um, well not thrown them, I've put them away for the baby because they were sort of just too small. Um, and these are quite thick. They've got quite a fleecy lining, so they're not going to be for the summer anyway. So these are gonna be more for winter. So I'm hoping that he'll grow into them by then. But yeah, just a variety of colors. So gray, blue, and red cover all the bases. The last thing that I bought that I wanted to show you um, were these little shoes. How cute are these? These are his first shoes, baby's first shoes. They're from a company called Vivo Barefoot and these are actually like designed so that it feels like their feet are walking like barefoot so the toes are like more spread out than usual shoes and they're really like flexible as you can see you can like squash them up and they're just really cute they are like made out of recycled materials they're completely vegan they've got a little velcro closing so they're easy to put on and off and he walks really nicely in these so yeah i was really pleased with these i do have a discount code um which they send to everyone i think but um if you're interested in buying these um have a look down below i'll pop my referral code in there for you 
So I hope you liked that video, just me sharing a few bits and bobs I've been buying for them. I did really want to buy them matching denim jackets in next. They looked so cute and but you know when you're adding things to your trolley and the price just got bigger and bigger. And I thought I can't really justify spending £40 on jackets for them. So I didn't buy those, but I really did want to buy them. Um what I didn't show you there is I also bought socks for my eldest boy as well. Um yeah, I think the baby will need some sleepwear we're pretty much done for summer apart from maybe a straw hat um and the girls because i passed clothes down for, through the girls as well the girls are quite sorted for clothes i think um but i might do a video if i if they need anything i might pop a little video on here but that would just be clothes for my teenager um because i've got a lot of her clothes that i've sorted through that i've passed down from my eldest to my second eldest daughter so I don't need that many girls clothes. It's always well worth saving clothes and passing them down. And we always, I always um, bag up the clothes that we've sort of grown out of and I'm not going to use. And I give them to friends, I give them to charity shop. I don't waste clothes because they're so expensive to buy new and everyone really appreciates the hand-me-down. I know I do, we've had lots of hand-me-downs from other people as well and we're always really grateful for them. So I hope you like watching this video. Do give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Leave me a comment down below, subscribe to my channel, anything like that would be great. And I'll see you soon. Bye.